morning. Good morning, everyone. Um, I'd just like to uh, speak to everyone about uh, this last weekend's activity. And understandably, there is a feeling of uneasiness in the community. And unfortunately, this is not new territory for the Bermuda Police Service or the members of our community. Uh, but we are equipped to, uh, with the tools to deal with these incidents. The Bermuda Police Service has a strong record of bringing dangerous, dangerous offenders before the courts, and we will continue to use all the resources at our disposal for these most recent incidents. Even with forensics and the abilities of our officers, though, the best tools at our availability is the members of our community who can assist in bringing these dangerous offenders to justice. And I would urge anyone that has in any information about any of these recent events to come forward and contact uh, either Crime Stoppers or the Serious Crime Unit. With that, I'm going to pass over to, <coughs> excuse me, Acting Chief Inspector Mark Clark, who's going to give you an op operational incident update on, uh, on the most recent uh, murder. About 10.45 p.m., Saturday the 21st of May, 2016, the Bermuda Police received multiple 911 calls to reports of gunshots in the area of Crossness Lane, Pembroke. Shortly thereafter, a male attended King Edward Memorial Hospital in the company of a family member. Despite the best efforts of the, of the members of the emergency department, he succumbed to his wounds. I can confirm the death of Mr. Patrick Allen Deal. Mr. Deal is not believed to have any gang affiliations. At the time of his shooting, he was entering his car to attend a party. He is a father of two, well known, loved by his family and friends. I would like to take this opportunity to extend my sincere condolences to his family and friends of Mr. Patrick Deal. Detectives from the Bermuda Police Serious Crime Unit are investigating this murder. The investigation has been led by me. We are anxious to speak to anyone in the Crossness Lane, Border Lane, Frizzles Hill, Parsons Road area who heard or saw anything that they feel would be of assistance. Someone in this community knows the identity of the culprit or culprits. I am appealing to anyone in the community that believes that this senseless killing must stop to come forward immediately and assist the police. We are appealing for anyone who has this information that can lead to the offenders answering to justice. All information is welcome and will be treated in the strictest of confidence. The Serious Crime Unit can be contacted on the following number, 247-1739. That is 247-1739. I thank you. Yes, he was outside of his home. Crossings Lane is just uh, yes. east of Deepdale Junction with Parsons Road. It is the first lane on the left, which is just off the tribe road that takes you to Frizzles Hill. I noticed also that you say he's not known to have any gang affiliation. Are mm -hmm. you suggesting that maybe he, it was a shooting by, what, mistaken identity, or was he targeted? What, is, what can you say about that? All investigative leads are being pursued, but at this juncture, we do not have any information that makes him an affiliate and or a member of a gang. 